Is your Windows update stuck at 30%? In this video, we'll show you how to fix it and get your update moving again. You can do this only when you have halted certain WU services. To do that, press the Win key and begin to write CMD. The next time, you see the command prompt. In the search results, right-click that and use the Run as Administrator. These are the four commands that you have to run to pause these Windows Update-related services. So, copy-paste these codes one at a time and hit Enter to execute them. After this, minimize the CMD terminal, go to the File Explorer, after this, head down to this folder, navigating through Files and Folders. See, Windows Our Software Distribution. Inside this Software Distribution folder, you will see the Data Store folder. Double-tap to open up that folder. Now, select all the contents inside this folder and click the Delete button to empty the folder. Come back to the Software Distribution folder. Then, enter the Download folder. Just like the before, select all the contents in there and delete those as well. This way, you have managed to clear the corrupted update packages. Finally, you can now start those halted services. To do that, write these codes one at a time and run these to start those services. When all these services are started, close the terminal. Don't forget to reboot the system. Try to update your Windows once more. Windows will start to download the update package from beginning. So, leave that in the background and restart your computer. Quickly, right tap the icon on the taskbar and then choose Run. Type this in the box and hit Enter to access the disk cleanup setup. Clean MGR. Choose the Windows drive, usually it is the C drive, from the drop down menu. Then tap OK to proceed. There, you shall see multiple items in the list. Make sure to tick mark these Windows Update related folders, delivery optimization files. Temporary Internet Files, Recycle Bin Tap, OK, to proceed. Windows will start clearing the files. Soon after clearing these files, restart your computer and try to update the system. Quickly use the Windows Plus I keys together. Once the Settings window opens up, head on to System. Go to the Troubleshoot Settings. Look whether you can find this Windows Update Troubleshooter. If you can't find that, open the other troubleshooters. Locate the Windows Update and tap Run to initiate the Windows Update Troubleshooter. Windows Update Troubleshooter will guide you through the entire troubleshooting process. Just follow the steps on the screen to fix the issue. Thanks for watching. If it helps, make sure to hit like and subscribe.